Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you a Pokemon TCG Online match for once. And it's going to be on this list of Zoroark, Lycanroc. So, it's practically basic to what everyone else plays. The only difference that I do is I do a one of Matt Cargo and then a Ditto instead of a Slugma because there's certain points that you need this or that you need to make sure you can get this out faster or get that out faster or get this out faster so that's what I do with that other than that it's pretty standard since I'm running a rainbow since I didn't have three unit energies it's not that big of a difference it's just one damage that actually makes it easier if I have to ace a roll but I mean it's it's pretty simple the three elm and all that yeah it's pretty simple so I'm going to get into a match real quick so um, this is the list that I use in person um, I like this list more than the other ones I've tested because it's just it, it's played out well it's a lot better than the other list that I've tried so Alright, I'm going second. I've seen worse hands before, but... Oh, cool. It's probably a mirror match. See what he grabs here. Oh, Lele. Grabs the two Zorwark and the Ditto, so. Alright. And he passes. So. Hmm. An Ultra Ball, a Kukui, and a Field Blower. I think I'm going to do the same myself. So I'm going to wonder tag for the elm. But instead, I'm going to grab Ditto, Rockruff, and a second Zorua. I'm going to play them all down. I don't have the energy attachment. That's not that bad of a thing. I don't like attaching energies until I have to with this because I don't know if they're running hammers or what they're doing. Now he's probably going to get the DC and get the knockout. Or not. That's good for me. So I'll attach that. I'll drop him down. I think I'm just going to Cynthia. Okay, not too bad. I'll evolve. I'm going to trade away a Elm. Okay. And again, I'm going to trade away an Ultra Ball. Okay. So... Now what I could have done is I could have gotten 
Hey, Mac Cargo. I could have gotten a Mac Cargo, yes, before I did this. But. Then. It seems like he's still not drawing into an energy, so that might be good on my side. Oh, okay, cool. All right, that's what I wanted to see. So now, I'm gonna Cynthia again. Oof, still no. So instead, because I don't really, preferably want to. Attack with Zoroark and on this one. Got that. Instead of using the timer ball, I'm just gonna trash it. There's no point. I'll drop that down. And actually, instead of killing his Zoroark, I'm going to go for this Lele. Because. I can always one shot with with claw slash at any point in time. So now there's two Zoroarks out. I see he's still not drawing into any energy so far. Probably gonna grab another Zoroark. Yep. playing Gyarados. Remember Gyarados does 50 times damage for every Magikarp in the discard, I think. And he grabbed a Weavile there. So he's going to take the knockout if he actually plays the Weavile. But that's if he can grab the energy. He, I've still not seen him. Okay, he's, he probably got the energy. Yep. So he is doing way more than kill. Yep. Okay. So I'll just lead up Zoroark. Drop that. I will trade Devoured Field. I will first of all what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna smooth over go 
grabbing Diancy. So I have a feeling that's going to come in handy pretty soon. Then I'm going to trade Ultra Ball away. Drop down Diancy. Okay. Pokemon Rescue Stretcher. Uh, Pokemon Rescue Stretcher. Pokemon Stretcher. Put those three back in the deck, and then I'm going to judge. Ah ha ha ha. Alright, and then I'm going to ride his beating. And I got a Zorak off of my prizes. Still have not seen him drop in energy. That's good on my side. Two magic card from the discard. And I've already got his ditto out of here. Grabbing another Zoroark. And I think that's his fourth trade. Ooh, he traded away a double a darkness energy. Darkness, a dark energy. Played a Marsh Shadow. Well, that sucks on my side because I had the double colorless. Okay, never mind. <laughs> Tate and Liza. He's probably going to shuffle his hand in his deck and draw five. He hit me for a hundred. So now, do that. Then I'm going to trade away an elm. Hmm. Could have done that, but not a big deal. Now I'm going to lose my bat. Now I'm going to smooth over. For an Ace Rolla. But I'm not going to trade because that will become helpful later on. Now right is being a knockout on that. Get a Lele. Now I can trade next turn. Let's see, but we got a 
Magikarp's actually does. Venting Anger. Yeah, 50 for each Magikarp in your discard pile. So all I need to do to win this coming turn is I need to, okay, so he's going to do that, that's fine. Well, now I don't have to explain it, now I can just show what I'm going to do. Put up Rock Ruff. going to evolve. I don't need to Bloodthirsty Eyes, but I will. Before I do anything else, I need to smooth over. Grab the unit energy. I'm going to trade away Tapu Lele. Attach the unit energy. Multi-switch over. Why not? Professor Kukui. It's overplay, but... And then I will call slash for knockout. 300. And that is... My list for Zoroark, Lycanroc. I think it's very... It's a very fluent deck. I haven't ever ran into a really bad problem with this deck ever. Like, against any... Any deck. Um... I'll probably do some more matches on it again. But I was only going to do one for today, but that is that deck. So stay tuned and thank you for watching.